Hey everybody, it's me, Sean. Welcome back to Terroir and our full up winery. We have got the new Pinot grapes growing this year. I haven't planted all of them, but we've got some planted and they want to purchase my empty lot. No, thank you. I am not gonna sell that to you. Now, if I wanted to plant these, Pinot grapes are purple. Okay, I just, I'm not gonna plant any, but I need to remember that for when we do bottling. Now, did I, uh, that's right, so I bottled up this stuff, but I didn't sell any. That's right, because we didn't have the spot to sell any. Oh, I got a four-star Similian. Simil, whatever. I got a four-star one out of that. So that is a 8857, huh? Okay. Hmm. Um, and I don't know... Let's see if we sell this one. Oh, so I still gotta wait. That one's worth a lot. Can I sell any in our tavern? Ugh, I, I really made a mistake by trying to sell our crappy wine here in our tavern. That was a bad idea. Um, oh well, let's not worry about it. Let's worry about trimming the uh, leaves off of some of our wines here if they get too full. Ah, we have the opportunity to sell more, so let's go do that. So we do need to sell some of this wine. So we have 2,040. 5160. Oh my gosh, we have so much of this Chardonnay. But great price. Let's do 3870 right there. We can't sell any more anywhere else. We're going to just sell that there. It's a good wine. They're going to be happy to buy it. And uh, now we need to go through and do a lot of trimming. Because otherwise, we're going to end up with a bunch of rotten grapes. And we don't want that. Now everything is going to continue growing, and that's bad. Not good for our... Stop it. Uh, don't I own that one? I thought I owned that one. All right. I guess I don't. Um, I own a different one. Uh, keep trimming these guys back. Yep, everything's down to a one. I need to get... I know there's like a special power that I can use to uh, to trim everything quickly. Um, full-time vineyard workers, permanent worker to each your tiles. Uh, yeah, I don't know about that one. Um, I do want that one, but that one's going to take a little while. Optimize foliage. Yeah. So hundred thousand dollars to research that though. All vines will have their leaves trimmed. Great, yeah, that's the one I want. Let's research that. All right, that'll help me out next year. And then I need to get that other. Well, I don't know what it costs to actually do it on a uh, on a one a one at a time basis. But I'll need to get that one thing that allows me to trim everything for free. Got to get, uh, got to get these guys uh, ripened up a little bit, please. Give me some decent skies. There we go, clear skies. I like it. That'll help the Similian to need to give it a little kick in the butt. There we are. And I guess this stuff is uh, not drying up like I would like. Let's keep those skies nice. Cloudy, I guess, is all right. Need to trim some more, though, because we need to get a little more ripeness now that September is here. More cloudy skies are not going to help me out any. Um, there we are. Those pinots are going to be overripe. Don't burn. Ah, they, oh no, fruit flies. All right, harvest. And let's, uh, let's treat these guys for flies. That's the only one I have, right? Okay, but I need to treat our Similian as well. Okay, Chardonnay looks fine. Similian, fine. Not so great on the Pinot though. I don't really know what I'm going for. Um, okay, 
Done. Let's smash them up. So, uh, we do want those tannins. So we're gonna use the, oh, we don't have motorized crusher. We have the traditional crusher. There we go. We're gonna use the traditional crusher here as well. Great. Not that we really need to push the tannins up on that one, but we'll push them up on this one. And, <coughs> excuse me. Um, although, hmm. Let's see, this increases it by two. And we want to... No, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay. Uh, and this one, it doesn't matter. Great. All right. Let's do it. Just make up your mind. And I still have some fruit flies that I need to get rid of. It looks like there. There we go. Good. Takes care of that. All right. Uh, what do we have going on here? So, fermentation, sweetness, Chardonnay. Chardonnay is perfectly fine. The uh, Similian. Uh, so apparently, a very sweet noble rot Similian is good. So I don't actually want to lower the sweetness on that one. And our Pinot, I think we do want to lower the sweetness on that one. So we're going to lower that. So it's still going to take us a while. But I looked at a guide on the Steam, whatever, guide page and uh yeah noble rot you want to leave that one sweet so there's different ratings whether your simulian has noble rot or not which is interesting all right um let's see what our tavern has got going on here good finally so we want to sell the expensive stuff here if we can so this one um i guess we'll put in 600 of those sell and let's go to the shop and sell what we can at the shop because we have a lot of wine sitting on our shelves here. Um, I'm going to sell these guys to just... Oh, no, I'm not going to sell them to anybody. So close that out. Let's uh, go with the... Let's try to get rid of some of this stuff. 591. There we go. Sell. All right. No. Help clear that out. Get us a little more cash. If we wanted to upgrade to the next thing, we probably need to have more uh, more renown, don't we? If we go to that, right? Um, upgrade costs 100 renown and $250,000, so we can't quite afford it either. But it'll be nice when we can, and it won't take us too long. And we can't really do anything there. And it's January, so nothing's going to change in our fields this year. We'll be able to plant that final field with Pinot. Um, so here, okay, so our Chardonnay, we do want to, let's see, we're going to want to decrease our tannins, and we want our acidity, so I guess we want our acidity up, and get it up to 8. Similian, we're going to want to have a low acidity, and we're going to want to have low tannins. So um, if I go two months, I want to go up by two. And then for our Pinot, our Pinot, we want to have an acidity of six. Oh my gosh, and tannins of two, huh? Uh, oh, we're not going to be able to get them down that far. But I will push that. Oh, wait, I want to push it up quite that high. Uh, we want to have it at eight if we're going to drop it down to six. So there we go. That's all good. Very good. All right. And there we are. So uh, we're going to put them into stainless steel, stainless steel, and stainless steel. Now, okay, great. So we're going to leave them all in there for a month. So we'll check back in February, see how they look. It's going to be a busy February for us. Uh, decline. Thank you. All right. So we've got 765 for this one. Let's bottle it. It is a green one. There we go. Bottle them all. For our Similian, 6105, huh? And we want 5103. So I'm going to let that one go another month. And for Pinot, we want 652. So I definitely need to let this one go another month. I should have raised the should have raised the uh, acidity up one more. 
Um, but that's all right. We'll be all right. Great. Let's plant more Pinot grapes. There we are. And um, I'd say we're off to a good start. All right, 420, leave that one alone. Can we sell to a regular sales thingy? Oh, we also didn't do the um, tasting on this one. All right, let's get the big wigs in on this one. It's not gonna be the greatest, so as a matter of fact, let's not necessarily get the big wigs in, but we'll get these four stars in. And we should do all right, very good. And uh, maybe we can win a prize with this one, so let's not worry about selling it. Let's worry about selling some of this older stuff that we've got just sitting around, like this one. You're waiting to sell. Nope, they're all waiting to sell, so we're just gonna wait till next month, I guess. And everything is ripening. Do we have, ah, good, cost 3,000. Well, that's cheap, we can afford that. All right. That's gonna get a little annoying. Um, oh, okay, let's use our fancy foliage trimmer. And we have to let that cool down to use it again on a different one, but that's okay, we'll continue doing it. How long does it take to cool down? It takes a little while, no big deal. And it's March, ah, let's get that stuff bottled before it's too late. So this is a Pinot, it goes in the dark bottle. And this is our Similian. Uh, it goes in the green bottle. There we are. Let's organize some tastings. So our Similian, we have five, ten, four with a floral. And okay, so this should be a pretty good one. We'll go with the four star people and see what they say. See how, how well that guide taught me. Look at that, five stars. Beautiful. And. Um, with our uh, Pinot 664, it's not really close. So we're gonna send this to the noobs and uh, maybe we'll manage to pull out a good rating with it all the same. There we are. Nice, five stars across the board. Great, so um, probably wanna try to maybe win some contests with these, but I think we're gonna get rid of this Pinot while we can. There we are. And what does our tavern look like? They're still waiting to sell stuff, so I'm not gonna add any more in there. Great, well, we're off to a good start. Let's uh, trim our uh, bushes here if I can. Probably shouldn't be using the super trim on the uh, ones that I can actually just trim manually. Ah, come on. Oh, so it doesn't trim them any further than that? Oh, okay, it does. Never mind. Seems like it just trims everything by one when you do the super trimmer. Ah, stupid rain. You're killing me. I'm never going to get my uh, stuff to ripen up. This rate. A lot to worry about when you have all these different varietals. More rain. Mm. Well, at least that gives us the noble rot, which is not, you know, which is good, I guess. But yeah, we can't keep up. It's tough. It's already August. trim these back a little further. Dunk. Ah, come on, son. Let's not burn anything, but we definitely need to ripen up. It's already September and everything's at a ripeness of one. Yikes. Not ideal. Let's see if we can get that up. Thank you, clear skies. I'll take it. Any 
anything that can be trimmed back further. Ah, there we go. Let's see. Don't bring me any rain for September. I mean, I can always just harvest it if we get rain. All right, not a great year, but I think we'll I think we'll be able to pull it out. And uh, we probably have stuff to sell. I've been so focused on trimming up those leaves. Um, got 2,500 of that one. Oh, and that's, ah, there we go. 3,500 of that one. I think I would still want to try to get those into a contest if I can. So let's sell these ones. 1080. There we go. Close. Close. Wow, didn't we have like $300,000 at the start of the year? <laughs> it's a lot of, a lot of money. Okay, not fantastic. That's good. Uh, all right. Well, we're going to have a little bit of a challenge with these. So, um, four tannins. So we can get our tannins up to seven here on our Simillion. Um, we can get our tannins up to seven there. On this one, let's get our tannins up to seven or eight. On this one, that's okay. It doesn't really matter because that means we can leave them in the uh, leave them in the vats for longer, which is good for us. All right, December. Let's see if we can sell any more. And um, let's see, we have a lot of 107. There we go. 1290 of those. And nope, everybody has got some going on. So we're not going to be able to do much. I'm not going to sell it to Krupp. And here, ah, here we are out. So here we're going to sell, no, $223. 600 Very good. All right. Now it's barreling time. Oh no, fermentation, yeah. Uh, decreases sweetness, we do not want to decrease sweetness. There, there, or here we want to decrease it by one. Yeah, our Chardonnay is already under sweet, so that's unfortunate for us. It's, this has noble rot, so we want it to be high. And this one, we want to get down one, so that's why we've got that set up. Great, so we're gonna push up the acidity when, uh, when we get the chance for that. And uh, in January, we're going to look at the seller again and see if we can sell anything. Oh, it looks like we could sell something now, so we'll open it up now. Uh, all right, so Chardonnay, we're looking for seven, six, six. We're not going to be able to drop the tannins down to six. Um, we can drop the tannins down to five, I guess, which means I want to raise this up to eight. There we go. Similian, I want to have an acidity of five and tannins of three. So I want to bring you up to seven. And for the Pinot, Pinot 652, 65. So I'm going to go two months there. So I want to get you up to eight. All right. Very nice. And now. So you guys are going to go in the French oak. You're going to go in French oak. You're going to go in stainless steel. Done. And I think everybody's going to sit for one month, except the other guy is going to sit for two. All right. So first off, let's look at uh, some of the stuff that we can sell off. We've got 1,290 of those. And 387 there. Good, sell. And that's that. And then here, we're still full. And do I want to bottle some of these guys up? 755, I do want to bottle that. It's not going to be great, but it'll be all right. Bottle. And 6105, I want to let that go for another month. And our Chardonnay, I mean our Pinot. 652. I want to let that go for another month as well. So we'll come back in February and take a look at those. Um, but I did bottle that one, right? So we can organize our tasting for this bad boy. Down here. There we are. 
Um, oh, and, and our, uh, we're almost full of bottles, so I got to get rid of some of this stuff. Um, and I wanted to hold some of it for a contest, but I don't think we're gonna quite going to be able to manage that. All right, so we'll have like a three-star review on the this, see how we do. Very good. And um, can I sell some of it? No, we're waiting on all of them. Okay, may not be able to bottle everything, but we're gonna we're gonna boost up our uh, boost up to level three winery here soon. All right, here's February decline, and we're gonna bottle this. Kino goes in the dark bottle with cork, and Smillion goes in the green bottle with cork. There we go. We don't have enough space in our cellar. 12, 16, 15, 20, 14. There we go, bottle. And um, let's organize our tasting. And uh, wait a minute, let's see. So this Similian 5104 is pretty close to where it's supposed to be. So we're gonna go ahead and organize that with, uh, we'll just do three stars to make sure we get the five star rating. There we go. And our Pinot is 654, which is also fairly close. We'll go with the three star rating for that one as well. There we go, very nice. Now, what do we want to sell? 1680, 720, 1560, 3360. And this is a Chardonnay. We'll sell that. Oh, no, can't sell anything right now. I've got to wait. It's too bad. But our uh, thing is full. If you clear out a little bit, am I selling some stuff here? Like that one. Didn't really make a big difference. Get us some renown. Oh, we should be able to. Let's, um, actually, we can do that. Let's uh, upgrade our thing. And then we can barrel up the rest of the stuff, that, or bottle up the rest of the stuff we have in barrels. Oh, we got to wait till next month, though. Oh, and somehow we still have $200,000, even though we just upgraded our... Did we sell that much wine? Holy moly. That's fantastic. Wow. So we'll put 25... 20 of that on sale. And that'll clear up room for us to wine or to uh, to bottle as well. And then I need to keep an eye on our plants because they're they're all ripening up. Trim these all back. These ones I can trim with the standard trim thingies. There we go. And, uh, oh, that's right, it's March. Don't don't forget about that. Oh, I guess it didn't really matter. Um, there we are. No, I put it in the wrong bottle, though. Dang it. Ah, now I gotta have a different tasting for this one. Oh, well. Maybe we can still get a five-star rating out of it. Oh, we did, even though it's in the wrong bottle. Very nice. All right. Um, somehow it considers it a different... Interesting. Huh. It's in a different bottle, but it considers it a different wine. All right. Uh, anybody ready to sell stuff? No, nobody's ready to sell anything. Calm down, Sean. Uh, we are ready to trim back the leaves on some of our plants, though. Oh, and there's the timer, which says we are ready to end the episode. So we're going to do that here in a minute. Um, thank you so much, everybody, for watching. I really appreciate you being here, and I hope you're having a good time. Uh, if you're enjoying this series, click that like button. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And I hope you will join me again real soon for the next episode, which will be up, uh, like I said, real soon. I'll see you then. Bye.